A warning as the weather warms up. Ticks are out there and they're biting mm. in our local mountains. And what they are carrying poses a serious health risk. CBS 2's Lisa Siegel is live in Van Nuys with ways to keep yourself safe. Lisa. Absolutely. And one local doctor we talked with said his own experience this past weekend shows just how bad this season will be, especially when it comes to ticks. Dr. David Maddian was at a scouts retreat this weekend with his kids in the Santa Monica Mountains. By the end of the night and after, he was treating half a dozen people for tick bites. They came in to see me with ticks actually attached to them or remnants of the ticks that were previously removed. He says in all his years practicing medicine and even growing up as a kid here, he's never seen it so bad. The people that I saw came to me with either bumps on them, rashes, a little prickling sensation, or in some cases, the actual mite hanging off of their skin. The CDC says infections from mosquitoes, ticks, and fleas have tripled in recent years, bringing with them diseases like Lyme disease, Rocky Mountain spotted fever, and even the possibility of the Zika virus. The doctor says the warm weather and recent rains made everything worse. You should really see a doctor if you get bitten by a tick because they can remove it correctly and they can do additional testing and treatment. So, he says, it's especially important to protect yourself. Cover up outside to avoid exposed skin. Buy pre-treated clothes with insecticide or spray your clothes yourself. Look for the ingredient permethrin and use insect repellent on your skin, making sure to reapply. And you want to use DEET, minimum of 20 percent. You could also use natural products like lemon oil. Dr. Maddian says what happened after the scouts retreat could happen anywhere. So you have to be careful to protect yourself and your kids. And while you might see things online on how to remove these ticks, the doctor says don't do it. Go to a doctor, have them remove it for your own safety.